just heard a, heard a turkey gobble out in this field. Saw him strutting here a little earlier, circled around. Had a couple hens with him, so we're gonna get out here. Hopefully make a few soft calls with the TC and using the spur slayer today. Hopefully, hopefully see if we can fire him up and see where he's at. Uh, got a little green field up here, surrounded all four sides by a thick hardwood forest. They like to come out in this little field here and strut. Springtime, if you can find these little fields, honey holes. But I saw him from the road. Probably five or six hundred yards off. I could just just make him out. He was a strutter and looked like a pretty good turkey. He had a full fan, so we'll go up here, see if we can get on him. Heck yeah, but there he is. Man, 
still got some life in him. Wow, man. That was an awesome hunt. And well, another quick DC hunt. team just got it done again. Um, another eastern bird hits the ground. It's been, been a great spring so far, and it's still early. We got a lot of hunting to do. Man, it's, it's a nice bird. Uh, saw this bird out strutting in a field. It's getting late morning. It's pushing probably 11 o'clock right now. Uh, he had two hens with him, and he was out strutting with them. Uh, set up, I actually called the two hens in before the before the gobbler came in at one spot. Called the hens in, and they got within probably five feet of me. And they knew something was up, and they fed off the other side of the hill. And I didn't know what had happened to him, but I cut one time, he gobbled just over the hill. Moved my camera around a little bit. Man, it wasn't, it wasn't probably four or five minutes. He was sitting right in front of me in a wide open field. I had zero cover. The camera's sitting up right out in the middle of a grassy field. Uh, caught him in to about 20, 25 yards. And laid him down with the old 12 gauge. But uh, I was using the TC Spur Slayer today. This is a, it's a split V cutter. And man, when you cut on that thing, if you wanna, if you wanna locate one, that right there, they cannot resist it. A little pat, 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 man. Wow. I mean, he was just hammering. I could hear him drumming the whole way for two or three minutes before I ever saw him. I could hear him drumming. But like I said, great spring morning, late morning hunt. I uh, had to work early this morning. Came out, TC, man. Love these calls. They're getting it done. Uh, Tori, and Jerry, and some of the other guys on the TC made for killing team are getting it done this spring and I'm trying to do my part up here so we're we're getting it done man these TC calls like we've always said they're just almost not fair for the for the turkeys so. but we're gonna get him out of here it was like I said it was a great hunt that was exciting call one out in the middle of a wide open green pasture field Come in full strut, drumming, gobbling. That's that's about as good as it gets. That, if that doesn't get your blood pumping, man, you need to stay at home because that was a fun hunt. But uh, let's get him out of here. It's late morning. Um, probably go eat some, get some breakfast, or probably be lunchtime. Time we get the feathers off this, but we'll. I can promise you, we'll be back at it again in the morning. So. Y'all stick with us. We got lots more hunts to come here at TC and the Made for Killing team. Getting it done. Spring Gobbler.